Welcome to Anatomy.app Explorer. The rib cage is composed of the sternum, costal cartilage, ribs, and thoracic vertebral bodies. It serves to safeguard the organs within the thoracic cavity, facilitate breathing, and offer support to the upper limbs. There are a total of 12 pairs of ribs. Posteriorly, the head of each rib articulates with the costal facet situated on the thoracic vertebral bodies while the rib tubercle connects with the facet on the vertebral transverse process. On the anterior side, all ribs, except for the 11th and 12th, terminate in costal cartilage. The initial seven ribs are known as the true ribs, directly attaching to the sternum via their costal cartilage. In contrast, the false ribs have indirect or no attachment to the sternum. Ribs 8 to 10 have their costal cartilages linked to the cartilage of the rib above them. Meanwhile, the floating ribs, 11th and 12th, are shorter and lack any attachment to the sternum or adjacent ribs. Each typical rib includes head, the uppermost part, resembling a wedge that articulates with two neighbouring thoracic vertebrae. Neck, a relatively short and flat section connecting the rib's head to its body. Tubercle a bony protrusion located on the lower back aspect of each typical rib, where the neck and body meet. It forms the costotransverse joint by connecting with the thoracic vertebra's transverse process. Body, shaft, the largest part of the rib, characterized by its thin, flat and curved shape, situated between the neck and the costal cartilage. During inhalation, all ribs externally rotate and elevate anteriorly, while internally rotating and depressing posteriorly. The reverse occurs during exhalation.